are workers' rights in River State being protected or even being uh, are, are they being protected enough or being protected at all? Uh, especially workers of construction uh, firms uh, in the state. Uh, hello, ninety point three. Welcome. Please go ahead. Hello, hard forty. Welcome. Please go on. Yeah. Hello, Dio. Good evening. Hi. Go ahead, please. Yeah, please. I I plead to remain anonymous. That's fine. Go ahead. Yeah, actually, Dio. I, I'm very but but happy be, before this. before you go on, I'd like to ask why do you want to be anonymous? Just give a reason. Yeah, I, I I'm actually one of the workers at the BBR side, the Bonny Road Construction. Okay, so why are you afraid to give your name? Daya, <clears throat> you know how this country is. No, I, 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 I needed to ex- I needed to explain. I that's all. Am I am I lose my job? Okay, all right, okay, that's fine. So so you're welcome. Go ahead then. Yeah. So actually. I was an eyewitness to what happened. The, the, the protest started as a result of non-payment of workers' allowances, um, swamp mangrove and swamp allowance, and other uh, other benefits from the company and low salary skill. You know, when when your people hear you're working with Jilos Becker, they will think, "Oh, everything is rosy and." All the rest start giving in their demands. And at the end of the day, by the end of the month, you end up borrowing money from either uh, senior workers or relatives. So we communicated to the company several times through our uh, committee committee leader, as in the union leader. But everything you had no result. Can I can I interject? Can I interject for a moment, please? So when you say yeah. low salary scale. Was this not the salary scale you agreed to before you took up the job? Dio, you before before you before you get employment for this job, they don't tell you look at what you will be paid. During the interview, they will screen you after screen you go for medical after they call they say sign here, sign here, sign here, and at the end of the day, they will take you to the site, give you a PPE, you started the work. It is when, at the end of the month, you now see, after the whole suffering, man, the job is very tough. And at the end of the day, you see that you're earning a meager amount of money. How much are you earning, for example? Dio, what we are earning, at the least, the, the helpers are earning 50-something thousand naira. Now, the basic salary, according to the payslip, the basic salary is not more than 16,000 naira. It is the, the other allowances they've agreed to pay that would uh, boost it up to 50 something thousand. And it's, it's so appalling that even our leader cannot say anything about it. Okay. We came also, out also another, couple of, another couple of questions. Pardon me, pardon me, pardon me. Pardon me. We'll, we'll go back to. Hello, sir. We'll, we'll go to what you've done about it and what led to the protest in a moment and the protest itself and what happened that day. Okay. But it's, it's important. Has, it's yeah, important. It's just a moment, please. Day. Just just a yeah. moment, sir. If you can hear me. It's important that I ask you these questions. And I hope you have enough airtime to sustain the conversation. Um, so, you said, uh, so I need to ask you this. Are you employees of Julius Burger or a different company? There we are employees of Julius Burger. Okay, so your employment letter was served to you by Julius Burger? Yes, yes, there. Okay, you mentioned some other allowances as well, swamp allowance and some other allowances. Swamp what allowances, um, um, what do you call it? Okay, and, and the other ones. So also, okay, were these, were these, I, I, I can't really were, pinpoint them now. Okay, that's fine. Were these, were these allowances agreed to before you commenced yeah, it's, work? It's, it's a kind of what is in their letter, their, okay. their appointment letter. Okay, all right. It is what the company does, not like we are the one putting it to them. Okay. That's, that's what they do. Okay, so let's go back so to, happens, let's like, go back to you. You communicated, you, co- you communicated them what happened. So uh, when we we barricaded the gate with some virgin palm frond as a normal thing in the River Rhine area, and we were singing peacefully, and then the the naval officers were there, the other police officers were there, the company uh, security were there. At the end of the day, they didn't come out. When the union chairman that we we've already declared personal non grata came out, we didn't talk to him. We booed him. He went back inside. He came out again, we booed him, he went back inside. 
So at the end of the day, after that day we left, the next day we came, Thursday we came, Friday we came. The, we are we are just waiting for the the company, the management, the, the multinational uh, uh, expat, expatriates come and talk to us, but they didn't come out. So reaching on Monday, by the time we could come Monday yesterday, they blocked yes, okay. they blocked us from afar. You, you, you were blocked from you, you were blocked from getting to where exactly? Yes, getting to where we were the other days. Which is where? Gate, which is where? With the uh, military officer. Which is where? Like around about. Which which is where? Area. Which is where, sir? Where where were you supposed? Where were you trying to get to before you encountered we're, the blockade? We're trying to get to the gate of the company where we were in the other days during the peaceful protest. Okay, where where is that? So, where is the company located? At Bodo. At Bodo. Okay, where exactly? Where, where exactly in Bodo? Bokana local government area at Bodo. Okay, go ahead. So when we got there, we saw that the, the, the military men has barricaded the they stopped every moment from the roundabout. So we gathered there at the point when they saw that well, when they saw that we were building up, they now chased us away that they don't want to see us there. So we now left there and went to the local government council to report to the chairman. On getting there, they said the chairman was not on seat. Then the secretary come, came out to address us. After addressing us, we're now like, okay, we would uh, converge and know what to do. But suddenly, the, the policeman we're talking about that used to work with empty tools, I don't know if it's air commander or stuff, he now came and did a tete-a-tete -tete with the secretary of the council. And the, the both of them shook their heads, and before you knew it, okay, we now said, okay, let's start going to know what to we'll do next. On getting close to the gate, we heard gunshots. When we, when we turned, some of us have uh, sustained injuries. We start struggling to carry them. Now, as I'm talking to you now, Samuel Ajay is dead. Who is who is and Samuel Ajay? Now, today, Hello, just to just a moment, please. Who is Samuel Ajay? He's a worker. He's a worker with us, too. One of your colleagues? Yes. Okay. He was shot in that incident? He was shot in the incident. He was among the people that uh, uh, sustained injury. How many, how, now, many, how many persons were shot in all? Uh, like six, six, at least six of us sustained injuries. Okay. So we no, 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 uh, not, sustained, not sustained injuries. How many persons were shot? Six. Six persons were shot. Uh, yes. of, of the six of persons who were shot how many are dead just one now just okay. one now we pray no other person joins uh, where, where, where are the others where are the others who were shot they are, they are, they are, they are, they are in the hospital taking medication who took them to the hospital it's still us the staff okay which which hospital were they taken to I'm sorry, I, I would not want to disclose that, please. Okay, that's fine. So, uh, the Mr. Ajayi, who you say is dead now, where where is his body? There are, there, there are several people running around for these things, and I, I, I may not be able to give the information of where he is right now. Okay, all right, that's please. fine as well. So, go ahead. So, this morning, uh, some of us went to the the company, and they said we should go back that they will call the staff when they are supposed to resume and stuff. We are also waiting for our national chairman to come and brief us. National from chairman of what? From Abuja. So, that's it. National chairman of what? Workers. National chairman of, of uh, Jilos Vega Workers Union. Okay, you have a workers union? Yeah, we have a workers union. That's what I was saying now. The, the chairman, the caretaker, the caretaker committee chairman that we we declared personal non grata was one of the things that came out to address us and we booed him because we, we, we were no longer comfortable with his leadership. That's it. So this incident happened yesterday and then today you all gathered at the site. Why did you gather at the site? Did you gather at the site to just to resume work or to do what? Uh, we want to know we want to know what the company is up to. Like now, when you when you yeah, gathered today, were you allowed were you allowed oh. access to the site today? No, they ch they chased us back that we should go. That when 
they are ready to call workers. Who chased you back? The security uh, of officers at the gate. Okay, what what time did that happen today? In the morning, like say past seven, because it was raining. Can you give Can you give a precise location as to where this site is? There's this office is. Okay, when you when you get to the the, the Las Vegas main yard, it's not uh, it is not hidden at um, um, Gokana border. When you get to Gokana. The major junction is Mogo Junction. When you get to Mogo Junction, you just take a bike. They tell them you're going to Las Vegas. They will take you straight down to Las Vegas Gate. That's where the road construction starts, and that's where the site is. Mm. Uh, did you did you yeah. encounter? Did you or your colleagues encounter any issues with the security operatives today? Today. Yes, today. No, none for now. You you were, you said you were told to go, and you'll be addressed later on. Who spoke to you exactly? The security officers at the gate. Okay, this time you were allowed to get to the gate. Yes. All right. So, what uh, what's the plan going forward? We don't know yet. We don't know yet. We don't know our fate, and a lot of us are waiting for salaries. We don't know what's happening. Salaries for this month of front salaries from the previous month. For, uh, for the for the previous month. Oh, you're being owed salaries? No, the, the, the company calendar is from 15 to 15. That's how their calendar is. Oh, oh, okay, okay. But even yeah. then, the, today's the 21st, so it should have been paid for the last month. Yeah, uh, uh, even at that, the, the, the payment comes like 25th to 6th, 24th, 25th to 6th. That's how they do their salary. Mm. Anyway. All right, so... um. You say you are uh, awaiting your national chairman of your union to come address you? Yes. What, when are you expecting your national chairman to... Uh... Yeah, he's, he's, he's supposed to come today, but we don't know. Maybe it's because of the rain. Mm. And how is uh, Mr. Jai's family? I imagine they must have heard about the unfortunate incident. It's really pathetic. We've not heard from them. I I I I, I heard it from the other states. No, we we not we don't, we don't know what's happening to them right now. It's so pathetic. It's so pathetic, Dio. I Dio. I I just wished. I just wished you would make this set an agenda on this. The, the world needs to hear what Jules Vega is doing to the staff.